I'm Josh with EG4 Electronics. Today we're going to be talking about an updated version of BMS Tools version 1.0. In this new version, you are able to communicate with up to six or more version 2 LL batteries using a USB-A to RS-485, pins 1B, 2A, connect to the battery COM on the EG4 LL version 2. This cable is supplied by Signature Solar. Then plug the USB-A cable into the USB-A port on a Windows computer. After opening BMS Tools version 1.0, first thing we gotta do is make sure that our COM cable is set correctly. So Windows has registered our COM cable as COM24. Next thing is to change our baud rate to 19200. While monitoring a multi-pack, we cannot use ID1 due to that being the inverter communication protocol. So on my six dip bank here, I have 64. Now we click start monitoring. From here on the BMS monitoring tab, we can see all of the basic information of this battery from state of charge, state of health, capacity remaining, amp hours remaining, all of the individual cell voltages. Now from here, we can monitor multiple batteries at one time. So if we click stop monitoring and then change our ID to two and now click start monitoring, we can now monitor the next battery below in the bank. If we click stop monitoring again and change to ID three, we can now monitor the third battery in this bank. Here on the historical record tab, we can monitor a real time uh, historical data collection that is occurring while the battery is powered on. Some generations of these EG4 LL batteries could require a firmware update uh, this firmware update can be found on the EG4 Electronics website under Downloads and EG4 LL version 2 battery. This was Josh from EG4 Electronics. If you have any questions, reach out to the EG4 Electronics tech support. Thanks for watching.